back everybody, time for the next final of the day. And have come the youngsters once more, Cadet Nines for their final. As they all head around, Kano Coldwell is in the back this time behind Jensen Clouch. As uh, they all head through and slow it all down. Am I missing one? I think I might be, uh, well, I reckon I'm looking at, well, maybe not, maybe not, maybe they are all there. All right, so in the final, 12 laps, Jack Masico, Vincent Terhorst, Slater Buck Brown, Jeff Mathers, and Riley Dawes out front. From the rear, Jensen Clout and Kano Coldwell in the four bangers. What can Riley Dawes this do, do this time? And who will get the win? Let me just get my camera back out again. Here we go then. Getting ready as they head round through pub. 12 laps is the duration. We are about to go green light racing. Cadet nine star with four SS cadets to boot. And away we go. Who gets the whole shot? Is it Masiko? Oh! Slaterbug tried, but he's got muscled out by two of them. So Slaterbug goes to third. Because Masiko got the whole shot. To horse has gone into second. Kano Coldwell, he's not taking prisoners. The four bangers right up there. He's in the mix as they come back towards me. Heading down through New Pub. Jet Mathers, remember, in a short while we'll be looking at his times. Kano Coldwell, meanwhile, is getting after the two strokes. And he's right on the back of Riley Dawes. And I think Riley Dawes is in trouble here. I think Kano Coldwell knows it too. I think Kano knows he's got some pace. And it looks like Jensen Clout is going to stay right with him this time. Through Wash It 1 they come. Heading down to Wash It 2. It is Masiko, Terhorst, Slaterberg, Riley Dawes, Kano Coldwell looking to go inside. Then Jensen Clout. Then Jeff Mathers. As they come back towards me once more. Still, Masiko holds the lead. Through they go in the Power Republic. And still, Jensen Clark right on the back of Riley Dawes, because guess what? He's already gone through Kano Coldwell up into P4 and chasing Slaterbug Brown. That is two stroke versus four stroke. And he is hunting him down. Masiko though, leads the way. Vincent Terhorst at the moment is holding them all off. But will Slaterbug Brown find some pace late on in this race? Back towards me they come. Cloud holds. Riley Dawes just in front of him. He'll be trying to reel him in. Who looks over the shoulder? There he goes. Jet made this all oh, a little bit of a slide that time. We'll look at his times very soon. Just gonna get a couple more photos as they continue back towards me. They've already gone through JG Cart. On to Washington one they go. Still, Masiko leads. From Vincent to Horse, but guess what? Here comes Slaterbug Brown. He's suddenly winding it up, and Slaterbug is after this top. This time he's got it going early. Back they'll come then. Still leading the way is Masiko. But there is possibly about to be a change for second place because Slaterberg coming, coming, Ooh, coming. Will he go now in JG Cart? He's closing up. Now he's going to do it on the brakes. Doesn't go through. Stays where he is. Back they'll head towards me. Down the back straight away. 
So I have about right on his tail. Caldwell leads Jensen Clash in the 4SS Cadet. But Kano Caldwell is right up there in the mix in P4 as Jens, as Jack Masico comes back towards me. Then to Horse, Brown, Gore, Mathers, is your order. Mathers has done a 53, one, two, six lap. Jet Mathers may well get a 52 under his belt in the final. He's looking faster and faster. That line was good from him. And this time the exit was almost good. He doesn't go to the edge of the track. He's trying to stay in the middle of the track. He doesn't use the whole circuit. If he just went to the edge on Power Republic, he would emerge way quicker. Way, way quicker. 53-3 that time. I know there's a 52 in him. He's just got to let it drift on the way out of Power Republic. Masiko leads. Slaterbug has gone into two. Now he, oh, Kano Coldwell trying to go P3. The Vorbanger getting after this. He's right behind Vincent Terhorst. Vincent holds him, holds him, but here comes Kano. Oh, he's going to go outside suicide. Now he's going to try the cutback, surely. On the brakes into JG Cart. Slaterbug is chasing Masiko. Now we're going to look at the times. The gap, 1.632 between Masiko and Slaterbug Brown as Riley Dawes goes through. Wash it too. Here comes Masiko. Following Masiko is Slaterbug. Vincent to horse, Kano Coldwell. Jensen Kurt. Riley Dawes. They all go through Power Republic. And was that a move from Kano? Was Kano going? You bet your life he was. Kano Coldwell up to third. The four banger has just got P3. Can he go any further? <coughs> Kano Coldwell, 50.044 is quickest lap. Sladerberg has done a 50.017. And that 1.6 second gap has become 1.3 as Slaterbug Brown is reeling in the Seco. <coughs> Do they come then? Back towards me now, Masiko, Slaterbug, Kano, Sir Horse. Then climbed. Then it's Riley Dawes. Here comes Jet Mathers. Jet then. 52. Oh, he's got a 52. 52.749 for Jet Mathers. Now you know what that means. We want a 51. Jet, we're not going to settle for a 52. We want a 51 second out of you, my friend. We want quicker times. We want you to nail this one. What does he do over the line? 52.6, he's getting quicker. Every single lap, he gets faster. And whoa, he's gone really wide there. Wow, he nearly lost the rear end. Coming in, JG Carr, brought it back. But it is still Masiko leading the way. Slaterbug was 1.356 behind. What is it this time? 1.348. Masiko's turned up the wick on him and trying to stay away with just three laps to go. Maders heads through Power Republic now. This will be a slow one, having got that big, big slide coming out of JG Cart. I'm expecting a 53 second lap. <laughs> As he goes over the line now and breaks the time of Beacon. 54.157, but here comes your leader. To Power Republic he comes, and it's still Masiko, Slaterbug, Kano Caldwell, Vincent Terhorst, then Jensen Clout and Riley Dawes. That is ten laps and just two to go. As Jet Mathers comes around better bends. Has this been a better lap? What's his second sector like? Oh, he's using all the track there. 
That was much better. Can he use all the track at Power Republic? In wide, out wide. Yes, he does. This could be a quick one. If the first sector was good, the second sector was the cracker. And Jet Mathers trying to beat a 52 645. Just puts it in. 53. Oh, the first sector must have been a slow one. The second sector looked good. Last that board is out. Masiko from Slay the Boat from Kano. And then still Vincent to horse. Jensen back is keeping Riley Dawes at bay. The four bang reverse a two stroke. And down sinkings they go. Meanwhile, the leader's coming down the back straight towards Washington too. Well, back towards me comes Jet Mathers. Mathers into Power Republic once again, learning the lines. Through he goes, comes out nice and wide once again. Straightens it up. Through Pub. 52, 6, 4, 5 to beat. Over the line he goes. 53. But it is. Cadet 9, the final. Your winner, Jack Masico. Second, Slater Buck Brown. Third, Vincent Terhorst. Fourth, Riley Dawes. Fifth will be Jack Mathers. And over the line, in the middle of them, Kano Caldwell absolutely nailed it in the 4SS Cadet. And Jensen Clyde finishes P2.